afternoon, visitors. The vessel that you see arriving is the Indiana Harbor. The Indiana Harbor was built in 1979 by the Bay Shipbuilding Company of Sturgeon Bay, Wisconsin. She measures 1,000 feet in length, 105 feet in width, and 56 feet in depth. She's powered by four 3,500 horsepower, 20-cylinder General Motors diesel engines, which give her a top speed of 14 knots, or about 16 miles per hour. She's also equipped with a 1,500 horsepower bow and stern thrusters to aid her maneuverability in port. The Indiana Harbor has 37 hatches on her deck, which open into seven cargo holds located below deck. Each hatch covering measures 56 by 11 feet, and she has a maximum carrying capacity of 78,900 tons. Above her deck, that thing that kind of looks like a crane, is a 250-foot self-unloading boom, which allows her to unload her own cargo at a rate of 10,000 tons per hour without the aid of shoreside equipment. The Indiana Harbor is owned and operated by the American Steamship Company of Williamsville, New York. She is named in honor of the Great Lakes Port, Indiana Harbor, Indiana, and she was the eighth of ten vessels built by the American Steamship Company under the Merchant Marine Act of 1970. This act allowed U.S. fleets to modernize their fleets with government financing. In 1983, she became the first U.S. flagged Great Lakes vessel to be installed with satellite communication. Since she has the largest carrying capacity of any thousand footer on the Great Lakes, She's broken several cargo records over the years and currently holds the record for largest cargo hauled through the Sioux Lock at 76,930 tons, which was iron ore pellets in 2019. She also holds loading records for most ore docks. If you see any crew on deck, Give them a big wave and welcome them back to the Twin Port. The Indiana Harbor is arriving today to load coal at the Superior Midwest Energy Terminal. Captain Salute. This time of year, with everything being so cold, sometimes those horns have a hard time honking. Once again, if you see any crew on deck, give them a big wave and welcome them back. 